Hey everybody, Carol here. I'm back with a swipe and a pendulum pour. Well, I thought I was done with these pendulum pours, but I guess not. So I'm doing my usual drizzle swipe where I put a base down, usually of white, but this time yellow, and then drizzle my colors around. Uh, look in the description below for all the details about the paints because I custom mixed some of them. So uh, it's too crazy to go over that now. Look down there if you want to see. So I'm just drizzling and my thought is I'm going to do a swipe from the center but on a diagonal. I don't want a bunch of big giant squishy cells. So my yellow paint is very thin. And as you see, I'm sparsely dropping the colors. So I know that it's probably not going to be the smoothest uh, swipe, but that's okay because I can go back and, and uh, fix it if necessary. So I'm using a really pretty magenta custom mix of colors. And I'm getting ready to swipe with uh, just a plastic sheet divider protector. And you see how icky that sw swiped. I realized I got to put more of this mauve around for a little more smooth swiping. And then I realized I didn't even put two other colors I had. I had a vermilion there and, and uh, another bright yellow and... So I quick did that before I went back to swiping again. That was like a lemon yellow. And now here we go. The plastic sheep protector. That's not the only thing I use, which you'll see. So you just put it down your edge so that it makes contact with the swipe color, but not necessarily the other colors, so that you can hopefully smoothly just pull that swipe color. But as I said, there's some little um breaks and things in my swipe because it is all very very thin but I'm able to fix it I used part of my plastic there and you'll see also that I go back in with uh, a credit card to touch up areas now I put a little more down here for the other side and I normally would turn this canvas around, but it's so long and bulky, it's a 12 by 24, I swiped in the opposite direction, which was a little bit awkward. So you can see I'm having a little more difficulty getting it to go smooth over there. But that's, again, okay. Swipes are a great thing to try if you're new to these techniques because they're fairly easy to uh, accomplish I think you can get some great great results so I did use spot-on treadmill silicone but I only put like a drop in each color except for the swipe color and the yellow base, of course. And then here you go. You see I'm going in with a credit card to fix the areas I, I screwed up. And it works just fine. Now, if you 
want bigger cells and more action, your paint needs to be a little thicker as far as amount goes. I don't mean in viscosity, but I mean you need to put a little more paint down so that it'll uh, smoothly glide across when you swipe and the cells will have enough paint for them to grow, come to the top and grow. I was not looking for that. So I'm pretty happy how this looks. I'll give it a good torch. You can see little cells and formations and things popping up, which is what I want. Just some interesting things popping up colors and shapes and I'm just going to touch up I wanted to spread that um, magenta color a little more on that side it was a little more sparse and just give that a quick torch again A little more touching up there. And we're good. One last torch where I fixed the paint. And then I let it dry completely. As you can see, I could put my hand over it before I hung up my pendulum which is, I've shown in past pendulum pours how I did it, but poked a hole in the bottom, tied the string to either side, swung it, hung it over a lamp. I got a little plumbing fixture uh, sitting there, slipped through the uh, string just to give it weight. And then here we go. And this is a yellow also with some yellow flash which I thought would make it dry really really pretty and cool and I'm just stopping it there and going to give it the other direction and uh, here we go I think it came out really cool after it's completely dry I'm going to paint the sides with that deep magenta swipe color because I think it'll look really cool that way so if you like what you see please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel share this video uh, join me on Facebook Instagram my Etsy store etc etc just see the description below and until next time please stay safe Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. And you guys have a great day.